Searchers are combing streets, fields, and woods in Butler County. They're looking for Caitlin Markham. Nine News reporter Jay Warren has been covering the search for us and joins us now at the command center with the latest. Jay? Well, Clyde, the search will go on for about another hour. This is a new level of organization that has not been present yet with the searches, and it is something that Caitlin Markham's father, Dave, is very happy with. Outside the church today, we spoke to Dave Markham, Caitlin's father. Dave says the organized search has been uplifting, but it's hard to stay positive. Definitely trying to keep busy and stay active and, and doing something um, helps pass the time, so to speak. Uh, that's the down moments and the alone times and the quiets. Um, that's when the mind starts, starts, and then you know that's when the emotions come in more. But with 150 people volunteering to search, led by Tim Miller of Texas EquiSearch, he's pleased with the organization. I, I respect and, and appreciate everybody's efforts, um, but we don't want to keep duplicating the same spots. Um, if something's been cleared, then move on. We joined this team of searchers this afternoon who drove up to Hamilton to search near Eaton Road. What would you otherwise have been doing today if you weren't here? Um, probably cleaning my house. <laughs> it's a lot more productive, isn't it? Oh, yeah, this, this needs to be done. They came out today because they feel if they had a loved one missing, that other people would do the same thing for them. If their family members were uh, missing of any kind, you would want everyone to, to do their best to try to find them. Yeah. Have you ever been on anything like this before? Uh, no. It's not a fun thing to do, but, you know, somebody's got to get out there and help look. Now, the specific mission of the searchers wasn't necessarily to go out into the woods and comb every square foot that they were looking at. They were actually closer to the roads, looking for tire tracks, perhaps, or easy places that something could have been dumped. Now, again, the search set to go for about another hour, and the crews are coming back in, and then it will set to begin tomorrow morning at 8 a.m.